Hello guys, in this video we are going to see 4 input NAND gate. Whenever all the inputs will be 1, then only we will get output as 0. So it is 1, 1, 1, and now it is 0. In this video we are going to see this connection. So let's get started. IC 7420 it is 4 input NAND gate IC. It has 2 NAND gates, gate 1 and gate 2. As you can see here, for the gate 1, pin number 1, 2, 4, 5 are the inputs and 6 is the output. And for gate 2, pin number 9, 10, 12 and 13 are the inputs and pin number 8 is output. Pin number 11 and 3 are no connection pin. Pin number 7 is ground pin and pin number 14 is plus VCC. We have to apply plus 5 volt. So this is the pin diagram of 7420. For the practical, I'll use gate number 1. So we are going to use pin number 1, 2, 4, 5 as inputs and pin number 6 as output. This is the NAND gate. It has 4 input, pin number 1, 2, 4 and 5. To provide input, we will use a switch. The other pin of the switch is connected to the plus 5 volt. This IC is digital IC, so we have to connect a pull down resistor with its input pin. I already explained why should we connect a pull down resistor with input pins. Link is given in the description below. The value is 10 kilo ohms. To see the input, we are going to connect an LED. And the series resistor value is 220 ohms. So this is the one pin connection and we have to do this to all of them. Now to see the output, we have to connect LED. The resistor value is 220 ohms. This is input A, input B, input C and input D. And it is output Y. For the NAND gate, Y equal to A dot B dot C dot D whole bar. If any input is 0, then we will get the output as 1. We will get output as 0 only if all the inputs are 1. And in any other case, we will get output as 1. Pin 14 should be connected to the plus 5 volt and pin 7 to the ground. So this is the circuit connection. Now we will see this in practical. One request. Please consider to subscribe my channel. This will motivate me to make more videos. Thank you. I'll use this kind of switch. 10K resistor. 220 ohms resistor. Blue and green LED. And this is the IC. 7420. Putting the IC. Pin 14 is connected to the positive rail. Pin 7 is connected to the ground. Connecting the 10 kilo ohms resistor with pin number 1, 2, 4 and 5. And then it is connected to the ground. Input A, input B, C and D. One pin of the switch is connected to the positive rail. Connecting the input LEDs. The positive is connected with the switch. And resistor is connected with the negative pins. And then it is connected to the ground. Switch A is connected to pin number 1. Switch B is connected to pin number 2. Switch C is connected to pin number 4. And switch D is connected to pin number 5. This is the input connection. Here it is output LED. This side is positive, this side is negative. With pin number 6, positive pin of the LED is connected. And with the negative pin, 220 ohms resistor is connected. So this is our connection. Now we have to connect the power supply. I am connecting 5 volt and negative. As you can see, if any input is 0, we will get 1. Here all the inputs are 0, we are getting 1. 1, 1, 1. Now 3 input is 1 and 1 is 0. Whenever all the inputs are 1, then we will get output as 0. So this is how 4 input NAND gate works. 
So guys, this is all for today. I hope you like this video. If so, then please like, share and subscribe to my channel. And if you have any doubt on this, then please let me know in the comment section. In the next video, I'll show you another topic. Till then, stay happy and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.